But, got a goose party. There are gooses. Here's the baby. Aww. Here they are. Nom 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 nom, huh? Yeah. They really like the lettuce. I noticed last time I came up, I put um, some lettuce and some kale in there, and then uh, well, they ate up all the lettuce, and then there was a layer of kale in the bottom. So I thought this time, they're gonna get all lettuce. Yeah, isn't that right, Easter? You guys like the lettuce because it's easier to chew, huh? See that, this goose is right there with me. I'm like right there. I'm so honored that these geese will come this close. Well, they won't let me pet them, but they come pretty close. And that tells me that they got nothing to worry about. But, you know, if one of the other geese reached out to peck them in the butt, they would also move away just the same as if I reached out to pet them on their tail. Like this one here. Yeah. Yeah, we keep about a three foot distance and we're good. Right? <laughs> That's Mama Goose. She just kind of threatened the baby, like, get out of here, I'm eating. Isn't that very nice? Figure since she lost her baby, she should be happy to have a baby, don't you think? Now you got another baby. What's your problem, lady? Gee. But all these geese, they accept the babies when they come usually. It's when you're an adult that you got a problem. Like it took a long time for Easter to get, to find his pecking order, so to speak. But the baby, I think they, uh, they all took them. They all took the new baby under their wings. And there's China Goose. This bird really loves to play nanny. Those two are definitely involved in it. A China Goose. Don't want me to pet him. I think it's a boy. I like to call him Perky because he won't, he swims around with his tail pointing to the sky. <laughs> yeah. Well, just going to make some short videos today. It's really hot and I want to go home. Even Easter doesn't want to be petted that much. It's too hot out for all that snuggly business. Yeah, but he let me pet him a little bit. Just not too much. Right, Easter? Anyways. Me and my soft little dumpling. Mm -hmm. I love my soft little dumpling. Yes, I do. Well, I'm going to hug him and kiss him and tell him goodbye. And maybe I'll go jump in a lake or something like that. Well, have a good day if you're watching.